going to read the title. The title says it all. Mm-hmm. I found this today on dailymail.co.uk. Oh, okay. Of course, Daily, Daily Mail. Mail. Yeah. Great journalism. Yeah, legit news. Lonely businessman, 41, <laughs> worth 25 million pounds, reveals his searching for a beautiful and successful woman to start a family with and take on luxury holidays so you, so could, wait, so <laughs> could you meet his very strict <laughs> criteria? Shotgun. <laughs> He's got a criteria, though. Mm, okay, yeah, let's I keep on going. Yep. You guys want to hear it? Yeah. Yep. Do you want to hear more backstory about him or just straight to the criteria? Uh, criteria is good enough. Like, what's wrong with him? <laughs> well, straight to the no, point. Yeah. The company? There's He's always from. a but as well. There's so a but. Yeah, what's let's his hear but? The but. <laughs> so, he's a CEO of a company called REL Capital. And apparently, he's been pre- previously married to succeeding. So, obviously, he's successful. So, he's he, dedicated his life to work. Yeah, he wants to share it with someone. So this this is actually funny. He um he used to date one of the atomic kittens. Ooh. <gasps> Which one? Let me find out for you. I don't. Oh uh, wait. <laughs> What's that whole again song? Oh yeah. Andy's Holy last again. girlfriend. Walking down the street. I don't even know the song. It's okay. Is this an Australian thing? No, atomic. It's atomic British. You know that the tide is Oh yeah. Okay, yeah, that I know. Oh yeah, I do know that song. That's a karaoke classic. Yeah, I have my karaoke buddy here. Oh yeah, hey, I I found my karaoke soulmate. You guys are karaoke. I heard about that. I heard about that. You guys are the only ones blazing up the the microphone. I want to see this. <laughs> next time, next time, we'll next do time, it. Next time, next time. We'll do it live on the podcast. <laughs> Andy's last girlfriend was Atomic Kitten star Liz McClanon. Oh. They met at a wedding in 2016, but their relationship faltered after two years because Liz, 38, didn't like flying. Oh, hell no. What? She didn't like wait, flying? What? She didn't wait, like wait, flying. Wait, wait, but what if it's first class? Was it first class? I assume it would be, yeah, right? Yeah, the CEO. She don't like, no, she doesn't like flying. Why does she, doesn't she go on tour and stuff? I have like, no idea. I don't know this girl. Well, she just She's takes just the an train? atomic kitten. Yeah. Kittens, <laughs> kittens don't, don't fly. <laughs> they do land on their feet, though. Oh, there's too many dad jokes, man. Wow, wow, wow. I gotta stop, bro. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so um, I'm gonna read the criteria. Mm, okay. Let me know if you guys are yeah, fit. Yeah, it's her. She looks pretty. Yeah, she aight. But right. she's 38. She's a bit out of his age now, you know? <laughs> yeah. Wait, what age range is he looking for? You'll find out. Oh, mm. my God. There's a long list. What that, does Andy oh. look for in an ideal partner? Mm, okay. So this is what <laughs> he wants. Taking notes. <laughs> yeah, taking notes. No, You're going to take some notes, yeah. Liz. Be Liz 2.0. Yeah. Andy, One. if you're listening. Andy, if you're listening. I got you, fam. That's what I'm about. Zoom in on this. <laughs> <laughs> be cute, be cute, be cute. So there's Natural. eight. Natural. <laughs> I try. There's eight points, guys. Okay. And we're going to get through them. One, he wants someone, in, an intelligent, special, unique person who doesn't take themselves too seriously and has lived an interesting life full wait, of experiences. Wait, that's literally like seven mm. points in one. Rejecting. Yeah, I know. <laughs> what the fuck? That's Rejecting. cheating. Yeah, that's very true, actually. <laughs> I know. That, that is like cheating. Sneaky. There's seven adjectives Yo, yo, yo. <laughs> He's sneaky. He made the rules. Yeah, yeah. He made the list, so I, I eight. can't. <laughs> eight points. <laughs> so eight times seven. Yeah. No, look, you, that's not even the best part. Rejecting mediocrity and has achieved something, whatever it might be. This what podcast. This what have podcast. you achieved today? What have you achieved? You did this podcast. Yeah, this podcast. Yeah. Yeah. She went to the gym. She went to the gym. I went to the gym, buddy. What Get them games. Today? I worked, man. You should work. What did you achieve? I worked. Damn. <laughs> I also so worked too. Worked. So Liz worked. You live work from home. That doesn't count. All right, we got three. We got three. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> new debate. Too wow. far. Too far. Yeah, too far. that is Sing another topic. Sing that is line. another topic. <laughs> <laughs> Number two, someone. Not born with a silver spoon in their mouth. Well, that's definitely not given yeah. everything. And a grafter like me, are you guys well off? No, no, definitely not. You live no. with me. You know I'm not well yeah, off. Yeah, no, that's right. No. That's true. Yeah. There you go, Andy. We're all poor here. <laughs> but <laughs> but I never cut my fruit. So you never what? <laughs> cut my fruit? No, 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 no. <laughs> Certain <laughs> sizes yeah, of that's fruit. True. Yeah, yeah. That's sorry. True. Oh, actually, no. When I lived at home, I didn't cut any fruit. <laughs> <laughs> Small or big. Silver all spoon. All sizes. All sizes. <laughs> she don't discriminate. We'll get back to that. All right. Mm, okay. <laughs> this is getting very interesting. Yeah. Number three. So you got you guys all fit the criteria right now. Yeah. So hey, num- you number don't three. include me in there. You, this is just for hypotheticals, babe. 
It's all right. It's all right. She can go. Three. <laughs> <laughs> hey, if he's rich, I'm good. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Hey, yo, Wendy, just pass me a couple million. Yeah, yeah. Just three. Life. I mean, if I fit all of them, I might, I might quit you. For I just me. need money though to launch my podcast. <laughs> three. Someone who is beautiful and keeps fit is very important. You've been going gym, babe. Mm, you got right. it. Mm, I don't gym, so. <laughs> okay, oh, right. out. You can always start. You can always start. You can always start, though. True. If you really yeah, want yeah. it. Yeah, yeah. 2020. It's all about, True. you know, new beginnings. But can you keep up? Can you keep up? <laughs> yes. Someone's very fit, very important. As I box and work out mm. five Boxing, times a week. Yeah, I do want to box Five yeah. times a week. Yeah. Five times a week. <laughs> they must take pride in their appearance. Mm. Eyebrows, girls. Yeah, it's eyebrows. It's all about the brows. It's about the brows, right? Mm. I, I know that now. I learned that. This guy sounds very shallow. I'm just saying. Yeah, but he's got 45 million. Yeah. I reckon it's hard for him to find someone with all that criteria. Oh, well, I mean, when our, you have that our money, standards are probably just as high, to be honest. Yeah. <laughs> that's an interesting point. Actually, that is a good topic. Yeah, like if we were to write down like a list of what we want, it would probably just be equal. We're going to get that. Yeah. We, we might get into that. I don't know. Mm. We, maybe. Yeah. We'll see yeah. sneak preview. Number four. Someone not addicted to their mobile phone and social media can stop <laughs> <up> and appreciate <laughs> the important things in life. I saw you grabbing your phone, KY. Oh. <laughs> not, you're not off to a good start, girl. <laughs> Damn. I mean, this podcast the... is all about social media. So, <laughs> yeah. That's true. You're still in the running. I think you guys, you're still in the What the hell? <laughs> the one girl that's not that's taken like, is still in the uh, Excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm everyone's ideal girl, huh? <laughs> All right. I'm going to use the sound for every single Wait, why aren't now. you not in the running? What? I'm yeah, still she's still running. I'm oh, still sorry. Running. My apologies, Liz. You're still in the running. Yes, I hope so. Like, all right. also still in the running. Okay, fine. You're all in the running. <laughs> okay. God damn, I can't argue. <laughs> <laughs> I can never damn. win. <laughs> it's three on one here. <laughs> all right. Point number five. We've got to get through these points, man. we still got a topic to go through. That's right. We've got an hour. Number five. Integrity is key for me. Trust is everything. Yeah, like mm. that's that's standard. That's standard. Right? If there's that's no standard. trust, there's no us. Yeah, you know, you're not gonna <laughs> oh, put like. Damn, that's hot. <laughs> as if he's gonna put like, I want scandal and infidelity. Yeah, he's gonna put the oh, bro. Of course, you want trust. Yeah, and they're gonna lie as well. So, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. Uh. Number six, a chameleon who is comfortable Wait. in all manner of situations. From attending a glam ball, being able to party all night at a beach party and behave like a big kid to rolling up their sleeves and helping me move house. It's really hard to find someone who can do it all. Mm. Well, that's very point. hard, Way man. too specific. Way, Way too, too specific. specific. There are at are you guys least all out? three sentences in that one point. Yeah. He's got yeah. Kids, man. He puts all these criteria in one point. That's not, that's not right. Like you want someone who's a chameleon. Nobody is a chameleon well if you have the multi-personality disorder maybe. <laughs> <laughs> valid <laughs> valid point valid. you minute, can stay in the I'm running just... for that <laughs> hello i'm liz hello, she, I'm Jenny. Hello. she gets it <laughs> i can party it's Ooh, patricia. <laughs> patricia it was patricia <laughs> it wasn't me patricia slept with the gardener <laughs> so who's this lisa that we have is it number one number four this is chill Lisa. Yeah, this know? is chilled Lisa right now, you know? Damn. She might, the coughing Lisa might come out. <laughs> <laughs> if you are racist, she'll come out. Yeah. <laughs> Almost there, guys. Number seven. Are you cringing or what? Man, that's long again. Yeah. Loves the outdoors and walks in the country. Being by and on the water. Being oh on God. a sailing boat. Preferably for a few days at a time. And sometimes oh not God. in comfort. So no princesses. Someone who is happy, just in a bikini and flip flops <laughs> with no makeup or mobile just phone for a few days. What? That sounds like uh, a psychopath. Me. <laughs> I think no one's in the running for that one. I'm starting to think this is bullshit. Wait, is so this really his list? So does he just like someone who can walk? Or <laughs> 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 very confident. He was like, "What do you mean? That's easy. I do. I do all those. I just breathe. I, I am just happy. Yeah. I, I just breathe. I exist." <laughs> What was it that Siv wanted? Someone that just breathes. Yeah. Mm. But he clarified a woman who breathes. Is that what Siv? Yeah. That's what yeah. Siv said, right? Yeah. yeah. Simple but, man, simple man, you know? Yeah. But I, I just like. think he wants someone who looks after their fitness. Obviously, someone beautiful. But yet, he wants someone that can be in a bikini and not care about her, her appearance. Yeah. yeah say, we're about to say period. No. <laughs> that's what you say. Appearance. Someone that doesn't care about their period. Well, that is going to happen. Like, Even these are just unrealistic standards. It yeah. is. It's, it's quite shallow. Well, this is the last point. 
and then we'll get into my main topic. Someone who wants children and is ready to settle down yet appreciate life doesn't have to end when you have kids. And then you can still go off traveling and have fun all together. I think everyone wants that. Mm. I don't think life ends when you, you know, yeah, that one's kids. fair. It's fair. Yeah. I can agree with him with this. I just that's don't a good, like that's a good specific number. Point. What is it? It started to be a bit off with the chameleon. The chameleon. You're not a fan of the chameleon. I'm yeah. a chameleon. So obviously these <laughs> 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 I just need the, you know, I don't need the soundboard anymore. I got me, man. I'm just gonna like, you <laughs> record her voice and then make it like a chameleon. <laughs> 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 <Yeah. laughs> <Yeah. laughs> so obviously these are very unrealistic standards. I can s- speak on behalf of my male counterparts. I really don't see this. Maybe the the 25 mil is a huge factor in why it, it definitely is definitely is because the money money changes things. Yep. Always. But I'll be honest with you. If we were to give any advice, all right, mm-hmm. like pretend like this is actually his list. He, this could be his list. I don't know. I just found this on Daily Mail. I don't know if it's legit. Mm. But I don't think he's gonna be able to find the one putting this kind of list out because you you're gonna have. You're going to have, yeah, you're going to get all chameleons. Everyone mm. that's just trying to fit this mold yeah. that he's yeah. set for mm. himself. And it's just going to be fake. And the, the yeah. facade will eventually run out. I think he needs, you know what he needs to do? Have you watched that movie, The Nanny? No, wait. No. The one with Scar- J-Lo. Oh, uh, oh, uh, um, The Made in Manhattan? That's the one. What? what? Wait, main or the new one? I don't think I've seen a new oh, trailer okay. movie. Oh, okay. Well, any any cliche movie where there's a chick and she's like she's peasant pretending. level. No, she's she's legit poor as. What's that movie? The one I really like, Pretty Woman. Ooh, yeah, oh, yeah the that's hooker. a good one. And then he, he he's hey, like hey, his yeah. kid she's not a hooker. She's a hooker, bro. She's an there's escort. nothing wrong with no, that. She is. She, she, yeah. Oh yeah, true. Oh, true. oh apologies. <laughs> Political correctness. Uh, <laughs> a bit more classier than a hooker. Yeah. She's yeah, an escort. Yeah. Wait, are you sure? I thought she was a hooker. I thought she was an Same, same. Because isn't same she thing, on the yeah. street? It's a higher class hooker. Yeah. That's all yeah. it is. Like, the, the, it's not just about doing it. You can, like, hang out. You can yeah. have Ca- dinner. Yeah, he's, she, yeah, she's the company of uh, Richard Gere. Yeah. Richard yeah. Gere's the man. Mm. I mean, in the end, I think he's just going to go for the simplest person. Because mm. it's hard when you're at this level. I think it's hard to find real people. Because real people, yeah. Let alone a partner, yeah. Is just not. I reckon you know what he should do. He should chuck a reverse Aladdin. So instead of like he's already rich, mm. pretend to be poor as shit um, and yeah. go out into the world. Because yeah. I feel like a lot of people will go in for the wrong reasons, right? 100%. It's like the Bachelorette, man. Yeah. People aren't there for the right reasons. Do you guys watch Bachelorette? Oh my god, the I, I love yeah. the Bachelor. Oh. Do you guys oh watch? God. Is there an Australian one or do you yeah, watch American? Oh, one? I watch Australian American one. one. Are you guys oh, you watching this them? season? Or no? no? Oh, this season is shit. Sorry, Peter, but this season is shit. I don't man. like Peter. Man. I haven't I watched like this Peter one. Yeah. Oh. You, you should. Yeah, it's oh. quite dramatic, but like, I don't find Peter attractive at all. Yeah, Peter's not attractive. I think Tyler should have. <laughs> Sorry, off track, off track. No, no, no. Sorry. Continue. This is great content. <laughs> there are, there's, no, there's literally podcasts where people discuss <laughs> Bachelor. Sorry, no, there's literally podcasts where people just discuss Bachelor. Oh, 100. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't wait, wait, wait. Podcast. So who's this? Peter, Peter from the, the Bachelor. Bachelor. Is so, it this season? Yeah, yeah this season. One. Yeah. yeah. So this oh. is your ideal guy? No, 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 no. He's a pilot. He he works for Delta. He's just a mess. I feel. Yeah, one hundred percent. He doesn't know what he do, he's doing. He, he so this is what you don't want. Yeah, he's yeah. he's like contradicting himself. He's trying like, to be too nice. Yeah, like, exactly. Like he has no lead. Um, yeah. When he gave what's her face that rose? Is that him? Oh, which one? The girl Peter who Weber? came back. Oh, the 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 sh- not, oh, oh yeah, her. Oh, yeah, yeah. Alicia or whatever. Yeah, that was such a slap in the face. Yeah, yeah. Oh, and what then, happened? And then he's like, yeah, sorry, no. What like, happened? <laughs> basically, like this girl got he sent this girl home. <laughs> yeah. Um, wait, wait, wait. So he's the bachelor and yeah. he gets to yeah. pick. Yeah. Girl. Okay, okay, yeah. okay. So he go. sent this girl home because like other girls were coming up to him saying like she's fake, like she's not here for the mm. right reason, whatever. So he sends her home, <gasps> and wait. then. And then there's this like whole group date challenge where like all these girls like basically fight it out all day in like a football yeah. match. And like after the date, like one of those girls are supposed to get a rose, right? But then she comes back like basically from the dead and was like, hey guys, I'm back. I'm going to talk to Peter. Yeah. And then Peter's like, oh, I actually made a mistake. Like I shouldn't have sent you home. <gasps> so he gives her the rose instead when like literally all the other girls like scrapped the so whole dumb. day yeah but and then they all hated yeah. it yeah but then afterwards he's like yeah no sorry gotta send you back ho- like send <laughs> yeah. you home again so then it was like contradicting so the whole thing her again. Yeah. yeah he's it's like so he should have yeah. so 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 is he what you 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 would classify as a fuck boy <laughs> no nah. no he's I think just, he's just he doesn't know what he wants he's just stupid 
It's stupid. Some guys are just dumb, like, bro. Dumb. He's dumb, bro. Yeah, he's dumb. He's and dumb. that's why he's, he's on dumb. that show. Yeah. <laughs> like, he's easily influenced and doesn't know what he wants, I think. At I face know. value, minus personality, minus the, the dumb dumb. Nah, he looks like a douche. Mm. You, doesn't, you, don't, you don't rate him? No? Oh, he, he's visually like he's quite a nice guy. Yeah. Oh, so he's a nice guy. He's yes. not a douche. He's he just feels dumb. too beta, though. Like yeah, hundred yeah. like percent. Like typical American. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Nice guy, but guy. doesn't know what he wants. Eh. Yeah. Which See? is most guys out there. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, male counterparts. Mm. You hear that? You got to know what you want. You, you mm-hmm. got to know. What, you got to go for it. You got to be confident. You yeah. Can't go into the bachelorette right, Karen, not knowing what you want. Eight, mm-hmm. 